Hey everyone, please check out my Patreon page. I'm sure you'll enjoy it, and there's a lot of nice prizes that are given monthly. Thank you to all my patrons, uh, the, the new ones, the older ones. I, I just thank you for all you've done for my channel. YouTube, uh, this is Chuck Generals again. I wanted to do a real short clip here. On, I got a chance to go out and do a little high banking. And uh, that's if the weather ever clears up. It's raining again today. We've had rain for two or three days now. And uh, a good friend of mine said, told me where there's water. So I'm changing the recirculator, uh, and I'm hoping it's going to be a quick change, back to uh, being a high banker. So when, what I've done now, and I'm, I'm into this for about 10 minutes, I pulled the twin 1100s off here, and you wouldn't think that would be a big deal, but you know, you've got all the wiring that had to be changed. Uh, the end, that end there had to change to this end here, which is the blank. Uh, that's, this is the plug for one side, because for the high bank I'm only going to use this one. Uh, and this is the 2,000 gallon per hour pump, yeah, 2,000, and it has this fitting on it, which is the same, only the hose is much bigger. This is, uh, I believe this is inch and a quarter, or inch and an eighth, one of the two. But now you see it has the same fitting that will go in here, and it's just as simple as, as that. I mean put a little bit more pressure on it so it doesn't blow off but and it's ready to go and with this big long hose on it now what we'll do is we'll do uh, put the pump in the water and we can have the uh, the high banker probably what is that probably three six nine almost ten feet away and I'm still going to run the battery on it this time to see how long the battery is going to last. And we'll put the battery over here. Uh, and part of the change was also changing from the uh, switch for the dual pumps to the switch for the single pump. And it's, it's the same switch, only it's uh, this wire different because there's only one of them. <laughs> okay, that's it. It took. Oh, a good 15 minutes, including this little short video clip. So, and it'll be ready to go. And the only other thing I might like to do, uh, and I showed you this once before, and now uh, my video is getting longer than I wanted, is these are steel legs. And I've got the square tube to put in there. And that will lighten this up by two or three more pounds. So, it's, I'm kicking it around. So anyhow, that's it for this one. Alright YouTube, it's uh, another one of those days. It's about the third day. It's raining and foggy and the sun's trying to come out but isn't quite making it. So we're going to do some testing here with the... Uh, it looks like we're set up to to recirculate but we're not. We're, I'll show you what we're doing. Okay, we're, the upper is set up to be a high banker now. The, this feed is plugged. You can't get any water out of it. This feed goes from three quarter. That's fed by an uh, inch and an eighth hose out of a 2,000 gallon per hour pump right there. We still had to use the tub because we don't have any creeks running here. But same old story with the wiring, the battery, the switch. Um, that's about it. My assistant here is going to do the shoveling. Hi. Oops, went too close. <laughs> Welcome. CNS Mining at you again. Okay, let's make some water go here. Well, let's see how much it pulls that tub down. Okay, it's doing good. I'm watching the pump. Wanted to make sure I was getting enough water down the sluice and uh, to keep the pump working. So, okay, everything's running. Everything's good. Um, that looks pretty good. 
So let's run some dirt. We have the dirt off already. This whole bank is dirt. Hey guys, it looks like we're ready to run some dirt to see what happens here. Very good so far. I like that. There's a couple big ones in there. This is dirt off our property, so I'm almost positive there's nothing in it, but you never know. I can see we got some organics. I didn't. Really good here. Yeah, so rake them rocks off the back. Yeah, there we go. That's good enough. And it doesn't seem to care how much uh, material you're feeding it. These may load up a little bit, but they'll clean out and we'll catch it down here. If he's just dumping the rest of that, that bucket, and it doesn't seem to care. Okay. That's all they cleaned out at the top. So we'll, uh, now when we go to the creek, this tub will not be here. Uh, that pump that back under there. will not be there. It's going to be over here probably about where the battery is uh, and that pump will be directly in the creek. Maybe with some kind of screening around it to keep debris out of it. So I'm thinking this all looks pretty good. Looks like another good test. The plug isn't leaking over here and this is the instrument and eighth hose he's now feeding now. Uh, it's wet that it's flashed. So, another successful test. Okay guys, I decided I'm going to actually pan this out. Uh, I just pulled the mat, uh, got the mat in the, the dish tub here. And I'm going to pan this just to see if possibly there are, is any material here. Or gold. Lots of material. I don't know about the gold. We'll have to see. Alright guys, let's Matt really caught some material. There's a lot of material here. It's not I'm not seeing a lot of black sand, but there's is a little black sand in there, so I am gonna pan it and I'll show you what I get. Alright guys, uh surprisingly there's a lot of black sand in this. It doesn't appear to be any gold to speak of. If it is it's teeny. Let me just peel this off. Yeah, I don't, I, oh, wait, yep, there's, let's see if I can show you this, there's one little piece right there at the end of my finger, a little speck, well, that's interesting, I might have to mine this whole backyard. Hi guys, so after a, a short test, uh, she's all cleaned up, pretty much. And ready to go and she's gonna to go to the creek and uh, we're gonna find some gold because there were some teeny teeny little specks of gold in that material I mean so teeny uh, I would have to change mats to, uh, to catch it all but uh, some was in this mat and some was in the lower mat but a lot of black sand so guys I'm really behind on my mail calls so I'm going to throw this in at the end of this video. And I, I got two of these stickers uh, from A&M. Uh, well, it's A&M Prospecting. I've got one on the uh, the Recirculator High Banker. And it, it's, they're really cool. Nice stickers. I really like these. And this one's a magnet. And this one is a sticker. And it's, these are... Uh, 
from Joey Brown who is a patron and that's the sticker and this one's the magnet but there was a lump on the back of this magnet and looky there look what's on the back it's a nice piece of gold on the back of this magnet and I don't think Joey uh, put it there accidentally I think that was an on purpose thing so Joey Brown I really appreciate it thank you so much thank you NM prospecting thank you both for for the stickers I appreciate it so anyhow if you like this short little video that was a success again give it a thumbs up share subscribe comment and come back and see us after we come back from the creek